Hello everyone, hope you're doing well. So today I'm gonna be designing my favorite room in my house. Actually, they're all my favorite, who am I kidding? But today we're designing a master bedroom with a bathroom and a walk-in closet. Yeah, it's gonna be fantastic. All right, so I'm gonna show you guys how to design this through the Room Sketch app. You get this app by designing 33 vacation homes in the Happy Home Paradise DLC. And it's amazing, man. You have full access to the entire catalog, even if you haven't unlocked the items. And it's just a great way to figure out what you wanna do before you order everything. So we're gonna be designing the upstairs of your house, which I'm pretty sure is six by 10. It always just looks weird like this. I think this is the right space. So I'm gonna start with the floors and the wallpaper. Usually I do like hardwoods or whatever, but like this purple carpet looks so good. I don't know why. For the main wall, we're gonna use this black hallway wall. It looks great with the purple. Trust me, okay, trust me. And then for the back accent wall, we're going to be using, where the hell? is it there it is cityscape wall so this is how it should look for now okay now i don't want the whole back wall to be windows so i'm gonna place out two partition walls and then put them in the corners over here and that just makes the window look a little bit smaller that way we can have a little bit more space for like the bathroom and then the closet is going to go over here and to connect all this we're going to get out two pillars two concrete pillars i think the concrete looks really good with like the black and the purple it's just a good neutral color and then one more partition wall to go over here this is where the bathroom's gonna go so and then a concrete pillar and another concrete pillar and this is the layout for the bathroom this is where the bathroom's gonna be it's gonna be a cute cozy tiny little bathroom and for the walk-in closet i'm gonna get out two more concrete pillars and it should line up just like that okay now let's move over to rugs and there's one in particular that i like to use for the bathroom it is this one gray brick rug it's not amazing but it works for what we're going for i just want the bathroom to have a different type of flooring than the carpet you know who, who uses carpet in their bathroom you know and to finish the walls i'm going to use this medium wooden partition and i'm going to make it black and this is going to close off the closet and there we go that's the walls i like using this medium partition because it just gives a little bit of depth you know, you'll see it, you'll, you'll see it, just trust me. And the last thing before we start decorating is the natural wood square tile. We wanna get out enough of these to fill in this whole space. So this is the walk-in closet. And there we go, so now each section has like its own flooring and it just looks different from having like purple carpet all over the, the space. Depth, guys, depth. And see, this is the actual foundation. All we have to do now is decorate, which is my favorite part. The decorations will like bring it all together. So if it looks weird, just uh, just hold on. It's, 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 leave me alone, it's gonna look good. So I'm gonna start with the best rug in the game. I don't care who you are. This elegant black rug, get out of here. It looks so good no matter which room you put it in. Look, look at that with the purple carpet. Tell me that doesn't look good. And I will tell you that you are wrong. So let me just go through the whole list and grab all the stuff that I know I wanna use. This office chair, but let's make it brown. Love it. An antique mini table, but we're gonna make this one black. This elegant console table, but we're gonna make it black as well. Nordic low table, also black. Are you seeing a theme here? This antique bed, which I think is a classic, man. Th this is the best bed, especially for like this modern look that we're going for. A table lamp, this antique radio, book stands, but navy blue, and the cartoonist set. But it's gonna be brown and I don't know, one of these, whichever, they all look good. An acoustic guitar and a Monstera, which I don't know which one of these I want. Maybe this? Yeah, let's, let's go for white. All right, this is enough to decorate at least this main area. So let me just put this together real quick. Swanky, I love it so much. We still need a few things I forgot to get, so let's go get those. We need a pet bed, a wooden bookshelf, and a chef, chefle, cheflera, cheflera. One of the best plants in the game, even though I can't pronounce it. All right, so this is gonna go in the corner. I love having plants in this corner. I don't know why. This pet bed's gonna go right next to the table. And then this bookcase, look how nice and cozy it fits right over here in this corner. Look at that. It's flush with the pillar and that doesn't happen a lot in this game. So that just, that gives me life. 
And that's all the decorations for this main room, which is going to look a lot better when I start adding in more lighting. So let's just keep going. It's going to look good. I promise. The bathroom's going to be super simple. So we need a bathroom sink, which I'm going to make black, of course. A tankless toilet, which we can keep that one. Yeah, let's keep it white. And that's it. That's all we're going to use for this tiny little bathroom. I'm going to put some stuff on the walls here in just a minute, but we'll do that later. And look at that, just like a cozy little bathroom in there. And now for my favorite part, the decorations for the closet. We need a full length mirror, corner clothing rack, mid-sized clothing rack, and two small clothing racks. Stacked shoe boxes, a golden wristwatch, cause we bougie, a key tray, and Rover's briefcase. All right, now I'm gonna speed decorate this. All right, and there is all the decorations for the walk-in closet. And you see how much nicer this wall looks because you can kind of see into it. If I would have used like a plain wall like this one, it wouldn't look as good. It would just kind of be a little bit more closed off. So again, I cannot stress depth enough. All right, so now I'm gonna decorate the ceiling. We're gonna use hanging light bulbs, two of them in the closet, a Nordic pendant light, which really you can't go wrong with any of the hanging lights, but I just like to use this one because it's gray. And then a spiral chandelier. Spiral chandelier is going to go over the bed. These two hanging light bulbs are going to go into the closet. You know what? Let's bring them out. There we go. It's kind of hard to see, but it's like in the middle right there is kind of where we want them to hang. And then this Nordic pendant light is going to go into the bathroom. And the very last part to bring all this together is the stuff that's going to go onto the walls. For the bathroom, I'm going to use the bathroom towel rack and this fancy frame. But we're going to make it silver with, uh, I guess this one. I don't know. This goes over the toilet and then this is going to go right in that spot. Yeah, I think it should be lower. So this is going to go down one and then this will go down right there. There we go. It looks a little bit more cluttered that way. And clutter is sometimes good. It just fills in the space. For this back wall, I'm going to use an iron wall lamp and I'm going to use the framed poster. But we're going to make it black with, uh, I don't know, this one? Vintage? Sure. That fits the vibe. This is going to go right here above the guitar. And then this is going to go over here. I think, you know what? Let's bring that up a little bit higher. Yeah, 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 right there. Okay. And the last part is in the closet. So all we need is another frame poster. I'm going to use, is there a silver? No, no, no. Okay, so gray with this photo, which I absolutely love. And then we'll have a wall planter and we'll make it, I think I use either black or gray, maybe gray. Let's do gray. And that's going to go just above the watch. And there we go. Now I'm going to turn off the lights and see, look how nice it looks. It's all just warm and cozy and I am here for it, man. If you don't see like all the different colors, they all just kind of blend in together. And I love it so much. But don't take my word for it. Here, take a look at this photo montage. Now, I often get asked, how do I find all these items? And there are multiple ways to do so, but the fastest way is by using Nook Mart. Just go to the nookmart.com, search for any items that you need, add them to your cart, complete the checkout process, but make sure that you use the promo code CORDLESSVII to get 20% off of your order every time you use it. It never expires. So just like use it always. And they will deliver right to your island within 15 minutes. Usually much sooner than that. Like scary sooner. I don't, I don't know how they do it. But these guys are amazing. I've been using them for over a year. You will not be breaking any terms of service because you're paying for their time, not for the intangible item in the game. So it's just another great option for people who don't have a lot of time on their hands or are extremely impatient like myself. The link is in the description if you want to check them out. But thank you all so much for watching. If you have any questions, please let me know in the comments. And also, I recently started a new channel for all my personal videos. That link will also be in the description. Just so many links in the description. Check it out. But thanks again, and I'll talk to you soon.